Hello everyone, this is the Prussian Prince. With our hearts to find for Waking the Tiger, let's play episode is China. China is becoming marvelous and great and glorious with all these encirclements. We are literally taking care of the Japanese scum that are attacking our land here. They will not get out of there. Won't make it out alive. That's for sure. Okay, can we take that guy? We're actually gonna force Menkukuo to capitulate. That's gonna be quite a shit. Quite a good development. Can we actually can we get that port there as well? That would be quite good. I really like where this is going actually. We're going to continue encircling stuff. Circling stuff is what we do, and Mekako has capitulated. They barely gave us anything, but they're never gonna give us anything anyway. That doesn't really change much. Okay, stop attacking there, don't waste soft attacks. Okay, decisions, decisions. 60 divisions. Integrate the army. Administration. Uh, Guangxi clique. Uh, let's take you guys. Oh, look, look at this though. What are you even trying to do here, guys? Invite foreign investors. They have been invited. Now, who do we need to boost? The Soviets. Soviet designer would give us quite a lot of stuff. <clears throat> Chinese General Staff Wargaming Division. How's our... Uh, mm, that's not really gonna help. Besides, what do you do want? Reach out to France. More arms expertise. Elite mountaineers. No. Support artillery. Now, do we want to go artillery route? We might. So reaching out to France might be cool. Mm, no, although Soviets would also help us. Do we want Chinese tanks though? Hmm. It's really rough. Of course, the USA side is completely crap. Looks like this. We don't want. We don't want Marines and uh, ships as China. No, thank you. Not gonna work with that. However, the British cooperation does seem quite interesting. It does seem to give us some stuff. Hmm. And uh, better fighters, really, like. Hmm. I don't know, man. This is interesting stuff, but not really sure. Hmm. Let's go with the Soviets and let's get some heavy weapons. Elite Mountaineers, though, that, that really does sound... Seems sort of a waste. Yes, closer ties. No, we're gonna help Soviets against Germany. That's what we're gonna do. Mission to the Soviet Union. Or, we can actually do that. Why should we not get an extra resource slot? That's pretty darn obvious, honestly. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do it. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, we're really getting across here. If we force these guys to surrender, then that's going to be just... Unbelievable. Can you guys just keep pushing across? I mean, already doing that anyway, but you can just continue doing it. Right. Why are you even doing it like that? No. Okay, so we just wipe more of them. That's more than fine. And we are, of course, killing those guys. Obviously, we are killing them. Please go and take all that land. We're actually we actually have better stats than the Japanese now. In terms of soft attack. That's that's too awesome. 120%. Okay, we're about to beat them. I don't think we're gonna wipe literally everything, but oh well. No, you guys moved to the wrong province. Whatever. Right, this is actually quite useful. Him attacking me like this means that I can definitely, definitely counterattack when uh, when the time is right. Okay, can we just 
can we rush their VP there? That might actually be good enough. Lily has joined the Axis. Of course, what else would, there, would they join? Now, can you can you please now just go there? Just go there. Okay, not gonna let those survive. Dalian is gonna be ours. I'm gonna try and cut off these guys here. That should be a lot of dead dudes. We're gonna go for Korea, that's gonna be just awesome. Do we actually have to take everything to make these guys surrender? Oh, okay. I guess we're gonna have to take a lot of the country to really make them surrender. Ah, oh well, I suppose that's okay. <clears throat> we'll take it. Oh my, we really need more mills though. We need more mills, okay. There you have it. I mean, I think our industry just got massively boosted by all the industry we just took back from like uh, Beijing and stuff. It's, uh, yeah, we gained back a lot of industry and we're now taking back even more. Just look at this. Why are you guys even going back? You're supposed to go to like Korea or something, you know? You know that, right? Yes. Oh, look at this. I mean, these guys are massive. Oh, and look at look. Just look at look at them. They're they're going down. <clears throat> they have more air than me, and they, I mean, ship-wise, we have a problem here. But I think this is not going to be an issue. Is it? Okay. This this is awesome. Look at them. They're gonna get wiped there, aren't they? Yes, they are. Everything here seems to be getting wiped. One way or another. They're not surviving this. They are not surviving this. Okay, we need to take that actually. Yeah, that's going to be quite important to take. This here seems to be what's gonna die. Right, a lot of snaking that we're actually doing right now, <laughs> but not like they have any units. Oh boy, no, let's not trade with you guys. Let's trade with the Soviets. Soviets are our new buddies. We need to trade with you guys. But we need to trade as much as we need. There we go. That's how much we need. Oh boy, our uh, industry though. That's getting massive. It really is becoming massive, isn't it? No, no, no. We could just, yeah, we could get to like 20 width actually. We could upgrade our divisions from that to 20 width. We probably have more infantry equipment right now. Yes, we do. So, I'm actually going to select all. On this view, though, in this view, and if we go that route, we can actually do it. That's fine. I'll just switch them to 20 width. That's fine. Garrisons, okay, I'm gonna cancel that because you probably don't. The USA is lend leasing me guns, okay, I'll take your guns, I'm USA, I suppose. Whatever. Yeah, now we got the 20 width. They're not particularly great, but, you know, they are what they are. Okay, can we actually wipe you before you get out of there? Would be quite nice, don't you think? Okay, so then we're gonna beeline that uh, port right there in Korea. <clears throat> we don't want the enemy to escape. Right, you let's get there, get there. Yeah, I mean, we are really taking a lot, and Manchukuo 
is not exactly giving up yet. 99%, literally we need like one province or something and I think they give up. There they have it. Really, two convoys. That's all Manchukuo had, I guess. Okay, so we are integrating the army right now, but... Do we really? No, we don't want to convert. That offers peace. What? War has been won. Hmm. Only be satisfied with total victory. No. Yes. Only total victory. My friend. Well, it would have been funny to see what would happen if I chose the other one, you know? But alas. A bit late to consider that now. Alright, so Soviets, I think they quite like us. Now, uh, Germany is doing Molotov Ribbentrop. Yunnan is happening. Okay, now this garrison here. We need. We need like two of you guys to go there, and this garrison needs to add more stuff. Oh, no, no, no. Select, and then garrison that. This. No, not that. This port, this port, this port. And there's also port here. I think that's basically it, right? And also attempt to lower resistance, sure. Lower resistance everywhere there, I guess. All right, so now that that should be just enough. Well, the ribbon drop has happened, and now can we actually just like, take all of this here? There's a lot of border door, and we need to fix it right now. Okay, we also need to convert these guys to 20 width, because then it would make it much easier to handle defenses and such. Though, like, it's a bit rough. Well, I mean, we'll be getting the recruitable. And that reinforce rate, which means 10 width is really going to be the best with this strategy. But in the last, I'm not going to play optimally. I mean, I'm going to need like a trillion units. A trillion commanders to use this. What is going on? Like, look at that. We need to produce a lot more mills in a lot more different places, it seems like. Like there. That, that should be just enough for now. Okay, so now... We're still integrating uh, some people, but, you know. I mean, we definitely need more steel. We're gonna go for the 39 infantry equipment. It's gonna be just fine. Oh, I should have gone for the... Oh, no. We can still go for 42 infantry equipment, actually. Although, then we can't really go for the tanks. That That's very unfortunate. Okay, we just got the chemical stuff. Which is awesome. Collaboration with the Japanese. Well, that can't happen. <laughs> um, All this stuff here doesn't really... Isn't really that worth it anymore? Okay, like, what are we doing here even? Where, w where would we go? Democratic. We already went the proper side. The side here isn't too proper. Okay, this is quite nice, actually. That's real concern. Oh, the mining commission looks quite nice, actually, if you ask me. And tanks, I suppose we have to... We're gonna go... Yes, Chinese heavy tanks, here we go. It sounds stupid, but that's what we're gonna go for. Okay. So now, my guys. My boys. I'm gonna make, like, a front line against, I guess, those guys. Yep. Now the garrisons here. Ooh. You actually really attacked into Shanghai. Oh, you, 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 you poor guys. Why would you do that? Because you're not gonna win that battle. Not in a million years. And there you go. We just retook Shanghai. We have construction three now. 
Which means we can probably actually go for support equipment. Believe it or not, finally we can tech support equipment. And we have a focus. We have a real focus. We're gonna go mission to Soviet Union, I guess. Yes, Soviets, help us. Okay, I guess they're gonna get wiped there. What? Oh, they actually found our ships. Do not engage. Do not engage. Get out. Okay, that unit is basically wiped. Now we're just gonna wipe this one. Wipe one after the other. Shanghai is holding all too well. Alright, so the garrison here... Oh, the, even Soviets are actually doing the garrison duty. I do like this. Zero convoys, but it doesn't really matter that much. Really need more political power, though. That is definitely gonna help. Let's go to speed four. We need it right now. Can we actually just please base over there and still on do not engage? All right, so we are almost at what we need, but really need to hire the Soviet designer. This is gonna happen in some time. We need to do this, and then we need to do that. Hire Soviet designer. Definitely. Okay, so now we have that. We need to do the infantry equipment designer. Volunteers from Soviet Union. I, I guess give me more volunteers. Whatever. I'll take them. How, how have we lost factories? Tell me it's the... Oh. No, it's not, actually. That's odd. We lost them somehow. Okay. Well, this is not what I was expecting. Like 96 is there, and then we have like, yeah. Well, I don't know, because this is actually pretty rough, also. There's not a lot of supply there, guys. You know what? I'm going to cancel all this. I'm gonna set up you guys. No, no, no. You guys like that, and then second army like this. And you guys, I'm gonna set you up right over there. And then you guys, I don't know where actually, I guess right over there, possibly, but it's a little bit rough. Okay, there we go. So we have set up the armies. Oh, these garrison people here, yeah. So we are missing on the infantry equipment, actually, but that's more than fine. It doesn't really matter. We have 20. Well, we need... It's probably like 14, I think it was. Once we have a... Uh, wave offensive, should be. Yeah. Oh, that's gonna make things so much better. The 15% reinforced rate? Brutal. Absolutely brutal. <laughs> gonna be really fun to test out and why exactly are we not properly defending these uh, ports definitely need more minus two percent three percent not guard the coastline though. are you yes guard naval bases and VPs what? No way, we just... Really? Delete your orders, my friend. Really? So, there you have it. Okay, now you, my friend. No, you're, you're doing a fine job. Okay. Okay, there we go. That should be okay. So, what, what now? We can do guerrilla warfare, which is awesome. And then we finish our... Uh, gonna finish this it's gonna be good we're still building a lot of mills which is as it should be you just build more mills guys build more mills Poland refuses German okay we're gonna switch yeah, in 22 days ish we're gonna have uh, new stuff wait wait has the war started actually yes Germany is gonna be able to 
probably kill Poland soon. That's my guess. And then let's see what's up. But anyway, that's enough for now. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on social media. See you all next time.